Hi guys, it's Lottie here. I had to show you these flowers. I bought them the other day from my local greengrocer. Fabulous lady who does the flowers and they're like more country-esque, country cottage garden flowers, which I absolutely love. And I thought I just have to do a blog on them because they are smelling so beautiful and they look so pretty. And I am about bringing the outdoors in as well as I am, as much as a gardener that I am. So I'm just gonna go through the different flowers that I've got and hopefully inspire you to shop local, get some nice English grown flowers in your home as well. So to start off with, this is a very seasonal flower right now. This is Allium. I believe this is Allium Christophii. It's a really pretty version and I love this variety. Look at the flowers. They're like little spiky spiders in purple. They're so cool. Great for adding some architecture and structure to your floral displays. So that's a really beautiful one to select for the season right now. Another seasonal beauty is this gorgeous lilac smells so good it's beautiful it's such a sweet scent so as well as getting beauty and floral in your home you can also get scent and fragrance in your home too with this one and it is naturally coming into flower right now so you can be sure this is nice and seasonal for your house such a good flower so pretty great garden shrub as well so if you have it as a garden shrub makes for a fantastic cut flower smelling delicious then for a bit of foliage eucalyptus such a good all-round bit of foliage for cut flowers really nice it's a good staple for any floral display you could also grow this in the garden now they can get quite big but what you can do is just keep it chopped and keep it low just purely use it for a cutting plant and it smells divine it works really nicely with the lilac that's in this bouquet it's nice and subtle and i just love that foliage gorgeous gray and silver so beautiful then we've got, now this one isn't actually in season normally for flowers, but it does add a nice bit of colour to the bouquet, so do forgive me. But this is a UK grown flower, it's not been imported, as far as I'm aware this is UK grown. Really nice aster, gorgeous delicate purple daisy like flowers, and this adds a little bit of height to the bouquet, and it's just really pretty. Now you, again you can grow asters yourself in the garden, but they generally flower late summer and early autumn. So this one has been brought on a bit, but it still looks great with our bouquet. It breaks up the pinks and the mauves and adds in a little bit of blue as well. Now lastly, if you guys can tell me what this is, I'd really appreciate it because I'm not 100% sure. I think it's like an amis, but I'm not 100%. But I just think it's great. It adds like clouds of beautiful white florals to my bouquet really pretty so if you guys know what this is make sure you let me know in the comments below i'll be really appreciated there we go so putting those together building our little bouquet here we go i'm gonna put that one at the front and that is our gorgeous english grown cut flowers that i bought from my local green grocer how fantastic is that never underestimate what's on your high street go and support the local shops see what they've got and you can create some fantastic floral displays in your home this one smells so good and i'm going to go and put it in a vase now and enjoy it for the rest of the week thanks so much for watching guys make sure you give me a like and a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video also comment down below if you would like to see any other videos or vlogs on cut flowers or in fact any garden plants that you can grow for your own cut flowers thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time bye